hey guys in this video we will show you how you can use our openai plugin to use the ai features that come with the openai itself so uh, for today we have just three examples here to show you how you can to just to give you an idea on how you can use our plugin because we get a lot of requests uh, online that how uh, from users that don't know how to use this plugin so this is this video is specifically going for those users so if you already know how the plugin works uh, you are good to go <laughs> otherwise you can continue watching the video so if you come into the plugin section of your app and just type chat gpt uh, the first two plugins are from zero code and by an alpha uh, the third plugin that comes from Chakor is built by me uh, so it has around 7000 something installs so I'm talking about this plugin so once you install it you will need to get your OpenAI keys and I'll show you how you can get those as well to get your OpenAI keys just type OpenAI on Google open their website and log in if you haven't logged in before you, you can sign up uh, on the platform before going forward once you are in it you can go for the API part and in here you will see view api keys and once you go here you can either uh, copy the first one i think you you are you will not be able to see the keys once you have already copied it uh, so it appears for the for one time only uh, so you can just create a new one uh, from here and just name it anything that you may like and just and please delete the previous one <laughs> just to make sure that your keys are not uh are not given to anyone that you don't want to do then uh, that you don't want to share it to okay so once you have your api keys you will need to come back into your plugin tab and you will need to paste your api keys so i'll show you that as well okay once you are in your plugins tab you need to find the open app plugin that you installed and you need to make sure that before pasting your api key you need to add this bearer space before the api key you need to make sure that this bearer is added here otherwise the key may not work so once you have it in uh, set up now we are good to go on the development part and start working on these so this is the editor of this app and i have not set up any workflow it's just a front end that is built so and we and how the front end works is this is just a input this is just a button and this is the place where we will where we will show the result that actually comes from the uh, op uh, the open ai and this text is getting its data from this parent group whose type of content is text so we'll what we will do is any uh, result that will come from open ai we'll just show it to this group here uh, and then this text will automatically get the result from this group. So once you start the edit workflow, you will write prompt. This will give you this AI, uh, this workflow, sorry. And then in here, you can just uh, dynamically uh, set the variable uh, of your question. So it will be put prompt example, its value. And then whatever the answer comes back for from it, we'll just display it in a group, which will be group prompt example. And it will show result of step ones, choices, first items, text. So this is kind of a uh, what you say in Urdu is a retta, uh, but the, the, but you need to just remember it for the first time, and you will be good to go so let's test this one and see if this has been integrated perfectly so let's say who was the first president of Pakistan and click send and let's wait for its response to come back and it says that, that the first president of the Pakistan was Muhammad Ali Zina, which is actually correct and let's test the image one as well now uh not test actually just make the workflow uh so once someone clicks send we should add a workflow which will be 
dolly create images and we will get a prompt from between mm -hmm. input image examples value and whatever the result comes we need to display it in a group and group will be input uh, group image example and we will show it the result of step one's data first items url and that will show the image so that will be a little bit slow uh but bear with me okay what should we ask it mm -hmm. no code superman came from krypton and click send usually this api takes a little bit of time because it needs to generate the um, image image and give you the result and then show it here so the image it takes time sometimes to load, to load as well so here we go this is the image that ai has generated for us and i'm not so impressed by the result but you get the idea so once you click on this send button so for the models we need to add a workflow which will be you will just select this open AI, uh, action which does not need any of the parameters and then just go for display data in a repeating loop which is just repeating group, repeating group text and get and just give it the result of step one's uh, data and it's each item's id and once you do it let it save so we are now ready to uh, get all of the models from openA. just click send and there you go these are all of the models that you can choose for different purposes for openA. and from and when you are sending the uh when you are sending the request you can change the models from here as well so this is the model that we are using for prompt uh, you can just change it and i think I'll, I'll give an update where you can also change the model for this api as well but i don't think that you will need it but i i can totally add it as well okay so we have gone through these three uh, first three uh, actions for now but we all i have also covered this convert speech to text after translation in another video which, which i will attach in the description also this chat completion uh, AI api is integrated into our chat gpt uh, template which you can see as well and these three uh, last three actions are uh, just those actions which are rarely used but uh, embeddings is a very important api so let me know if you want a video on these as well i i can totally make that as well all right i think this was a very quick fun and casual video uh so let me know if you want more of these all right have a good day bye, -bye.